A new rumor claims that the Walt Disney Company and Marvel Studios are trying to rework their Disney Plus Ironheart series because they are unhappy with the product as it currently stands. Before we get into this, I'd like to ask if you could please hit that subscribe button, hit that bell for notifications so you don't miss any of our future videos for the Trent Report. All right, let's get into this here. This is over at thatparkplace.com. Wrote this article up earlier today. Headline reads, Rumor, Marvel Studios reworking Ironheart after actor claimed the show would be something that, quote, little trans kids and trans teens have something to look at. Indeed, the latest rumor from uh, Scooper Thwipped T on X says Marvel is not happy with the quality of Ironheart and are reworking it. That is the gist of the rumor. While it's unclear what is making Marvel Studios unhappy about the show, it was revealed last year that the Disney Plus show would very much be pushing a transgender message. Back in August 2022, Deadline reported the series cast an actor using the name of Zoe Tarakis, who claims to be transgender and non-binary, for an unnamed role. This announcement was made shortly after Entertainment Weekly announced that RuPaul Drag Race All-Star 7 finalist Shay Coule would play a series regular. Tarakis made it abundantly clear that the show would attempt to groom children, telling Collider... I think as trans people, I mean, growing up, I didn't get to see myself anywhere, so I didn't really know that I existed, and especially not in a superhero show or movie. The actor continues saying, and so I think I just feel deeply grateful and moved that little trans kids and trans teens have something to look at and to know they exist and to know that they can have superpowers, and that's where we belong. We don't just belong in trauma stories on the fringes, dying in things. We belong there with the big guys. It meant a lot to me. The series' status was left up in the air back in February when The Hollywood Reporter noted the series was, quote, unlikely to arrive in 2023 as the studio spreads out its content and tinkers in post-production. Marvel Studios boss Kevin Feige had previously announced at San Diego Comic-Con in 2022 that the show, along with Agatha Coven of Chaos and Echo, would arrive in 2023. Uh, the Hollywood Reporter report came after Feige informed Entertainment Weekly the studio would not be putting out, uh, would not only be putting out fewer shows every year, but would also be spacing them out more. He said, we want Marvel Studios and the MCU projects to really stand out and stand above. So people will see that as we get further into phase five and six, the pace at which we're putting out the Disney Plus shows will change so they can each get a chance to, to shine. When asked for clarification on if, on if he meant spacing them out or putting out fewer shows, Feige replied, both, I think. In September, The Hollywood Reporter noted the entire series was off Marvel Studios' schedule. Boris Kitt reported Ironheart, a show focused on genius inventor Riri Williams, Dominique Thorne, First introduced in Black Panther Wakanda Forever was to have dropped this fall, but that is now off the schedule. It finished shooting, but its completion is affected by the strikes. Marvel Studios would also announce they were changing how they make TV in October with the Hollywood Reporter's Boris Kidd also saying this. Showrunners will write pilots and show Bibles, the days of Marvel shooting an entire series from She-Hulk to Secret Invasion. Then looking at what's uh, working and what's not are done. Uh, Marvel Studios head of streaming television and animation Brad Winderbaum confirmed these changes, saying it's a, a term showrunner we've not only grown comfortable with, but also learned to embrace. He added, we need executives that are dedicated to this medium, that are going to focus on streaming, focus on television, because they are two different forms. We're trying to marry the Marvel culture with the traditional television culture. It comes down to how can we tell stories in television that honor what's so great about the source material? As for my thoughts, I don't think that any reworking of this show will make it palatable to viewers i think the only way that they can potentially get some of their money back on the cost that they've spent on this is to do a back roll and completely cancel it and get a tax write-off this show uh, should never be aired on disney plus people are going to reject it it will be worse than the viewership on miss marvel there's no doubt in my mind uh, but those are my thoughts on the matter let me know what you guys think about ironheart do you think that the uh, show should be canceled? Do you think that they should rework it and try and salvage it? Or do you have any other ideas on what Disney should do with this show? Again, let me know in the comments below.